How cute you are. Look at my silkies. They're so adorable. You guys are like little puppies. are so cute. <laughs> Hi. How are you? Good morning, chickies. Right, guys this is such sad news today when we went to let the chickens out this morning we found one of our silkies she had passed away she was by the door her whole head and neck was wet made no sense at all the rest of her was fluffy we're pretty sure that it was a snake that got in if you see all this it's all crusty, like with a mucus. See how stuck it is? It's so sad. So basically a snake would have gotten into our chicken coop last night and would have probably killed the chicken first by strangling it and then tried to consume it and couldn't. So then they let go of it. This has happened a lot with other people where a snake gets in, this is a a really good sign that you had a snake that killed your chicken. When the head is wet and the neck is wet, it's all crusty, there's lots of mucus on there. She's not that big of a chicken. She's almost six months old. She's a silky, which they stay smaller. They're very soft, feathery. And all of our chickens had food and water. Our Older chickens, they just ignore these silky chickens. They've done really well with them. So more than likely it had nothing to do with another chicken. It definitely had to have been a snake, probably a smaller snake because a smaller one, that's why they couldn't consume the chicken in eating her. So we're very sad. This was Alyssa's chicken. She is the one that loves silkies. She's my oldest daughter. We have wanted silkies for years. She had one about eight years ago named Jazz and Jazz had passed away and it took a long time to find some silky babies and now her chicken was the first one to go from a snake. So this is another reality of having a homestead. There's gonna be accidents and tragedies that are gonna happen, unfortunately. So we're gonna go look at the chicken coop Obviously, we're gonna to try to repair a few areas that maybe this snake got into. It's really hard to know exactly what happened. The one hole that we found that a snake can get in is right there. Can you see daylight? Um, can I see daylight? Yes, I can. Lots of chicken poop. Time to clean again, huh? Oh, Sam, that's a big poop. <sighs> I know. Out. Where did this snake? Question is, where is the snake? That's the question. Anyway, so that one needs to be repaired. And what else did we see? Where's that other hole at? Somewhere there was another hole. I don't think, I don't think a snake's gonna be in Rico's stall. Oh yeah, they would. See that crack? I don't think a fat snake would fit through that crack. No, it'd be a smaller one. And that's what we think happened. Somewhere they showed me a hole. It's weird. Oh, right there. Uh. Snake can get in there for sure. 
pretty high off the ground. I know it is. So I think those are the only two spots. Because all this, they can't really. 